This is my second review of the standard manufacturing switch gun. Uh, the first gun I had, uh, I had several issues with it. Check the link below and, and uh, review that video. They sent me out a second uh, switch gun after I returned the first defective one. Now I'm having issues with the second uh, switch gun. The, I don't know if I can show you here, the uh, screw at the bottom here, the housing that releases the actual cylinder uh, began to unscrew. I've seen other videos where um, they're reviewing this and this, is, this screw is actually coming out, but they didn't notice, but I did. And I'm having the same issues with this one. I've uh, screwed it back in. Now, I'm having cycling issues or timing issues with this particular weapon. I don't know if I can show you. You can see where it's off-centered. I cocked it back, and you can see in the barrel where it's off-centered, which means when you fire this weapon, you're going to have uh, lead shavings. My fear is, you know, will this gun explode if, you know, I continue to have uh, uh, cycling issues with this. Uh, again, this is truly unacceptable. I cannot return this weapon. All I can do is uh, return it for, not for a refund, but I can return it for repair. Uh, but not, I cannot get my money back for this. I went around to several, uh, dealers, um, dealers, gun dealers, and they will only give me $200 for this particular pistol, standard manufacturing switch gun, which I was very disappointed, uh, about. Uh, I paid, um, almost $500 for this particular pistol two months ago. But anyway, look at my review, uh, original review below, but I definitely recommend not to get this weapon. Again, if you look at the cylinder where it's all centered, uh, that's a danger. That is a danger. Thank you very much.